going into my dose of colors oh by the grace of god i'm just gonna take my lashes these are in the shade hold on my nail dirty i'm gonna test this out keep in mind that i'm an artist it's Matic Monday. channel it is charity center and i am back with another video today is matic monday okay season two i think this is episode four or five y'all know psh, i don't feel all the way off but as you can see you know this is me getting back on track so i wanted to go ahead and hit y'all with a little new episode of matic monday because i did not forget about it okay Medic Monday is a part of me. It's what I created and I love it. Okay, so I'm here just giving off fall vibes on accident though because I wasn't expecting this. Y'all know I usually do my nudes, right? So I tried this lip and I thought it was going to be a little bit more nude. I thought it was going to be nude, like this mauve type of nude color, but it was deeper than expected. But I ended up leaving it because I just like how it goes with the look. So, um, yeah, this is the look I created today. Just giving y'all some blue vibes with the little gold, little cut crease. You know what I'm saying? So, if you are interested to see how I got this look, just keep on watching. So, going in with my MAC Paint Pot in Soft Ochre. I am going to prime my lids using this one today. You know, just to kind of stray away from painterly because I use it all the time. So yes, I know I mentioned working out of three different palettes today. I am so sorry. So I am going into my MAC Flamboyant palette and I'm taking this shade right here to go ahead and use it as my transition shade. Taking that on a Morphe M573 brush. I did not need to use this shade, honestly. The only reason I'm using it now is because I did it on the other eye, but I wish I wouldn't have because it wasn't even needed. Going into the MacBook by The Crayon Case, I am taking this orange shade right here. Um, going in with a Morphe M17 brush or E17, it's E, not M. And taking that directly in my crease and I'm also gonna overlap that with the transition shade. And that's why I said I didn't need it because this orange could have been my transition shade, honestly. I'm just going to go in circular motions, you know what I'm saying? And blending that in, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Going back into that flamboyant palette by MAC, taking this red shade and going into going in with my Morphe M506 brush, taking that directly into my crease. And we just gonna blend that out. I love this color. This is so beautiful. They blend in together. How they look up against each other. These colors are so beautiful. It's reminding me of the uh, Cherry Sunset from Taco Bell. 
Have y'all had that new drink? The Cherry Sunset from Taco Bell. It is so amazing. I haven't had it um, since they brought it out because I'm on this little, little diet or whatever. So, going back into my Soft Ochre Paint Pot from MAC, I'm going to cut my crease. This part, I can't really do no talking on this part because, you know what I'm saying? I can't really be distracted. And what I like to do is, as you can see, I don't know if you really can see, but I just like to do a quick sketch at first, like that. You see, and then now that you have your line, you can just fill it in and you don't gotta be careful because you know, I already did your quick little sketch, you know what I'm saying? Like that, you feel me? Okay. Okay, so now, going into my Dose of Color Snow Angels palette, I'm gonna be taking this blue shade, picking that on a MAC 242 brush, and I'm just going to Pat that into my lid. Just kind of doing, you know, a little pat and press. You know what I'm saying? This blue is so pigmented. I was so happy when I first used it. It's just so pigmented. So beautiful. So what I'm gonna do is, let me find this name. Go into my NYX liner in the shade Crystal Gold. I'm just gonna outline the crease. Now this part I really cannot talk. Oh, by the grace of God. Okay. And she's complete. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna line with my NYX um, little liquid liner. And I'm gonna start in the middle first, just so I can go ahead and create the angle I want. For how thick I want it to be, you know what I'm saying? Then I'm gonna create the tail. Bring that down to connect, you know what I'm saying? And then we're gonna take it to the inner corner. Go ahead and complete that. There is so much makeup in my nose, it's so funny. Like just so much dry makeup. I don't know if y'all can see it, it might look like I got a booger, but I swear it's just dry foundation. And then we just filling it on in, y'all. Four lashes I'm taking Freakum. And this is from KCK Lashes. Okay, I am back to complete the look. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna take the blue again from my Dose of Colors palette, taking my Morphe M506 brush. And I am going to go right up under there. I'm gonna switch brushes. Going in with my Morphe E36 brush. And I'm patting it in for the best uh, color payoff. Okay, and I'm gonna take that same brush, going back in with this red from the MAC Flamboyant palette. Gonna go right along the edges of that. Put that right under that blue. Taking my Urban Decay Troublemaker Mascara and just going on those lower lashes, getting it up in there. So then I'm gonna go over that with my L'Oreal uh, Voluminous Lash Paradise Mascara. 
Oh yay. Major rock stars. It's freaking starving. You know what? It's time to freaking eat. I didn't even eat breakfast. That's horrible. Like who would let me not eat breakfast? Okay, let's get into lips. I have no idea if this lip combo combination is gonna work out, but we're gonna try just in case. So I'm gonna line my lips with Chestnut by MAC. Y'all already know the deal. And I'm going into this NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick. And this is called Vintage Retro, or is it just Vintage? I don't know, I got a little splash in between. Yeah, let's just do this. Let's let's get into fall with this, okay? Kicking off fall with this. This is cute, so I can't I can't even be mad at it. Okay, so this is the look, okay? Like I love actually I love how it like all looks together. Like it's really beautiful like this is so fall and this is like so fall on accident because I didn't even mean to um create a fall look you know I was just going with whatever I created in my head just put it on my face and it came out like this I love it I love it so much like I hope y'all really like this look you know what I'm saying I'm in love and I even like how the lip goes with it because y'all know me okay this is new but it is so pretty like it goes with the look i was about to take it off and change it until i looked in my viewfinder so you know i really like it but i hope y'all enjoyed today's video please be sure to comment down below let me know what y'all want to see from me on my channel and then give this video a big thumbs up for me and then subscribe to my channel and turn on your post notifications so you will be notified whenever i do upload thank you all so much for watching and i will see you all in my next one bye guys